Whether you have a broken knob or just want to make a fast, fun update to your home by sprucing up the doors, you don't need to call a handyman to help. With the right tools and simple instructions, it's not difficult to DIY doorknobs. Today, I'm going to show you just how easy it is to replace a standard size doorknob. Most doorknobs have two screws visible in the faceplate. To loosen the doorknob, take a Phillips head screwdriver and turn the screws counterclockwise. If there aren't any screws, insert an object into the latch hole. For round latch holes, try a paper clip, and for flat, thin ones, try a flat head screwdriver. Press on the hole to disengage the knob. Hold the door with one hand while you pull and detach the doorknob from the door. If it feels stuck, don't be afraid to wiggle it. With some doorknobs, you may need to take a flathead screwdriver to pry the faceplate from the door, revealing the screws underneath. Next, remove the screws from the top and the bottom of the latch. If there are no screws, you can actually skip this step and pry it off the door with a flathead screwdriver. After this, all parts of your doorknob should now be removed from your door. The latch bolt is the piece that goes into the door frame so you can close the door. One side will be beveled and the other side will be flat. Insert the latch so the flat side is on the inside of the room to ensure the door will lock from the inside. Make the hole larger if it doesn't fit easily. Line up the holes in the door with the holes in your latch face plate and screw it in. If there is an indentation in your door for the latch face plate, make sure that you push it in. Use existing screw holes for any new screws and tighten the screws above and below the latch to secure the plate. Push the bars on the external knob through the holes in the latch. These bars should line up with the holes on the inside part of your latch. Line up the holes and push your knob through. Oh, just like that. Attach the faceplate to the outer part of your door. Put in your screws and tighten them and then add on your outer plate if you have one. If the interior doorknob was not attached to the faceplate, connect the doorknob and screw it onto the door. You definitely want your strike plate to match your new doorknob, so be sure to replace it with the one that comes in the package. And there you have it. If you decide to try changing a doorknob for yourself, who knows what other DIY doors will open for you next. If you found this video helpful, leave us a comment and let us know what tips you want to see from us next.